this is the 2020 Tesla Plaid, and I've owned a 2020 Performance with Ludacris, and there are a lot of things different that are actually a lot better on the Plaid itself. One is the charging is, I've been to this charger a lot in our other car, and Sorry, the stock is annoying. And it didn't see, <laughs> you accidentally press the buttons and it does that. But anyways, the charging at this station before in my 2020, normally by the time you got to halfway, it starts feathering it down. And so far I've charged 88 miles and it's been at 148, 149 kilowatt the whole time. Whereas with the other, it would have been down to like 70, 75 by now. Uh, so it is nice around that. Another thing that I've noticed that's nicer for us when we're drag racing is usually in your model, uh, the 2020 Model S, um, with Ludacris, it had chill sport and then ludicrous and then ludicrous plus well ludicrous plus was what they're now calling drag race mode when you would pick that to do launch control and everything usually it would take you a half hour to charge well now when you do drag strip mode it um, only takes five to ten minutes so it's a lot quicker um, which is nice I'll um, have another video of showing all of that mode and actually the funny thing is is so when you do this you can hear it'll turn on all the fans to cool everything down and now you can see it actually the amount of energy it's using to put it into that mode has pulled down the kilowatt charging down five or six kilowatts I can hear a lot of fans kick on while it does that so I'm going to do some no prep this weekend, drag racing, so we'll see how it works. This one has the 19 inch rims, which a lot of people don't have, um, so we'll see how it hooks, and I'll probably upload one of those videos as well.